Known popularly as Lamb in the local wall of language, wrestling is a national sport in Senegal and commands a big interest across the nation. But not during the holy month of Ramadan. Wrestling venues are empty and the fans are missing. In fact, only young boys could be seen wrestling, helping to keep the momentum going during its current break. But for professional wrestlers, the Atlantic Ocean provides the first point of call after breaking their fast early in the evening as they all training for the upcoming matches. Because of Ramadan, we have been forced to reduce our training by up to 70% as there are no competitions. That is why there are few people training here today, otherwise there would have been 30 to 40 wrestlers. As they pace about during the training, these wrestlers combine religion and love for the sport in a delicate balance. We respect wrestling, it's a cultural sport, but our Islamic religion is more important than wrestling. We have been training and competing for the whole year, but for this one month of Ramadan, we have no choice but to fast. But fasting during the month of Ramadan comes with a price they must pay for immediately they resume competition. During this period, a lot of wrestlers lose weight because of fasting Ramadan. Some of us will therefore compete in lower weight divisions as we make our way back to our previous wrestling categories. Ramadan or no Ramadan, they say a professional wrestler must show the strength of physical, mental and spiritual character to be deserving of the title. A lot of sporting activities have been suspended in the predominantly Muslim country of Senegal. And for professional wrestlers eyeing their matches after this period, they are forced to train lightly and after Ramadan hours. Sadiq Shaban, CCTV, Dakar.